So let's talk about X Defiant. And for those of you who don't know, it's Ubisoft's version of Call of Duty. A 6v6 arena shooter with abilities, customizable weapons, and microtransactions. Right, now this game is free to play, which I gotta give him credit for that. But let's talk about if this thing has a future, what are the current issues, what are some of the things I like about the game, and so forth. All right, so let's start at what's wrong with the game, because everybody loves negativity, right? So the netcode is definitely better from the beta, but it's still not great. I died a lot around corners, and that's something that definitely needs to be fixed. The audio is not there, it's non-existent. You can hear gunshots, but footsteps, you, you do not know where the enemy is. They will run up on you in a heartbeat. So I'm not a fan of the footstep audio itself. Everything else seems okay with the audio, the, the, the gunshots, uh, the environmental stuff. I'm not, I'm no problem with that whatsoever, but the footstep audio is but. Next up, we're gonna talk about the abilities. Abilities are pretty good. Um, I think the balancing is a little off. I kind of feel like there's like two factions that are kind of overpowered, that being the recon goggles and the flame dude. Those guys just seem to dominate the scene right now. They definitely nerfed the libertard, libtard faction into the ground because the healing just isn't as strong as it used to be. Um, on the account of it actually has to recharge. You don't get it in your next life. You have to wait for, for the uh, Q to recharge. So I think some balancing on that would be okay. Leveling the weapons up takes forever. Like, probably played it two hours and popped two boosters, and my M4 is only at level six. So, leveling weapons up takes forever. Now, I understand why they did this to keep you playing the game, but they could tone it back just a hair. So, something about the aiming was just not right. Um, I don't know how to explain it, but it just seems like the bullets didn't go where you shoot. Kind of Modern Warfare 2 y. Um, not a fan of that, obviously, because I want the bullets to go where I shoot. There's a, bu a bunch of visual clutter on the screen. There's always some kind of alert or uh, just garbage on the screen. I don't know what these this obsession with just cluttering the screen with a bunch of visual clutter. I just don't know what other word to use. Just garbage where it makes it harder to aim. I don't know what the obsession is with developers, but they need to tone that down some. Like, it doesn't make the game more fun. It just makes it where I can't see what the heck I'm shooting at. So, aside from that, the game actually played fairly well. Um, so let's talk about some things that are good. The gunplay felt pretty good. There's like this tap strafing mechanic, which for those of you who don't know in Apex, you can actually change directions while you're midair. So in X Defiant, when you're in the air, you can actually change directions. I actually kind of like that aspect of the game. It kind of adds some depth to it. Uh, raises the skill ceiling. Um, the movement mechanics, like I said, I, I, I do enjoy that. Um, I also feel like the maps were pretty good. Um, I don't really have any problems with most of the maps. Um, the input-based matchmaking, I think, was fantastic. I think, and the S no SBMM and casual playlist, I think, is just wonderful. Like, probably the best part of this game is the no SBMM and casual. Absolutely knocked it out of the park. Congrats on that. And I also think that, you know, with the factions, even though they need, they need balancing, I do also think that adds a lot of depth to it that Call of Duty doesn't have. So... Again, knocked it out of the park with that. I do enjoy having factions and abilities. So ultimately, will X Defiant make it? And I think that's gonna come down to how long they're willing to stick it out because I think it's gonna take some time for this game to gain traction. There's gonna be a short burst of interest that's gonna fade off like a lot of the other shooters that have come out recently. But if they can keep pumping content and they're committed to the long haul, I do think it has a shot. Now that being said, when I say pump content in, they have got to release a game mode that is more high stakes than just arena shooters. Now it doesn't have to be a, be a battle royale, but a tournament style shooter like the finals, like a four teams of three kind of tournament style game would definitely, definitely increase the chances. It has to have some kind of high stakes game mode outside of multiplayer to increase the longevity. I mean, battle royales I don't think are going anywhere. Extraction shooters seem to be the new wave, but I only think that's gonna appeal to a certain select few of the player base of any game. So yeah, a uh, high stakes game mode would, would definitely, I think, take this thing off. And again, how long they're willing to kind of stick it out, grind it out, and pump money into it even if the player base kind of dwindles for the next few months so we're gonna see um hopefully it sticks around all competition to call of duty is a good thing it makes call of duty and the developers 
are forced to improve their game. So we shall see. Now it's your turn. Let me know in the comments what you guys think is the future of X Defiant. We'll catch you in the next one. Oh my god, I could not see you. This is sitting in the truck. Oh my god, you healed. I hate that. Yeah, he's got a good spot in there. Ugh. We got it past 30%. <laughs> we did better than last time, right? Your turn on D. Send that package backwards. I'm not tired of using the marksman. I just wanna How is it? I mean it's it's a quick kill if you can track them. Because it takes about two shots. But I feel like if you miss that third shot, it takes two to three. If you miss that third shot, you're dead. I definitely could do a lot better with the M4. Wow, I did not hit. I am, I am so bad. <laughs> <laughs> and I thought I was hitting them, but it was really just the incinerary. <laughs> Bro, I can't tell you how how bad that one hurt. They all ran by me because I snuck behind the door. Another piss. That was a beautiful flame. Oh my god, I've been nasty. Oh god, I didn't mean. Jesus, bro, he popped out on my ass.
What was that, bro? He killed me using the M4? I think the fire guys might be like that in the sonar goggles character is a... Uh... OP? Yeah. Oh no. Nope, 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 grenade. <laughs> Please tell me I, did, I killed someone with that. Okay, I did. Creamy dirt bike. How's it taste? No, dude. How do you get up? Ah, uh, he must have. And there, another crushing loss. It's not over till it's over, bro. It's pretty much over, though. Yeah. GG. GG. Bro, we can't get a dub, man. What the hell? <laughs> but you're frying at this game, bro. There's a few good ones. I'm gonna pause the uh, thing for a minute. Wait, that works for me. Got a stream snipe Cobb or Hobbs. 